looking uh, pretty good weather-wise. It is only a one-day tournament, so get to spend tomorrow on the weather with your family. Holiday weekend. Though with Pittsburgh, you never know where the weather's going to end up. But anyways, here we go. All right, and so it looks like what we're going to see here is Young Link is going to do a lot of platform camping up on the top platform and um, just kind of try to come down every so often to make sure that his teammate is okay. Because um, when he gets caught in the fray, he doesn't really have many options to get out. However, um, Elijah is kind of going in right now. Looks like they just have the Mark Theater going on there beside. Um, yeah, Launch Air is actually doing an excellent job of just uh, staying safe. From oh, at, right as I say that, gets caught. Oh, the Barely missed the boomerang there. That would have been a really nice save from uh, Lijin if he was able to hit that boomerang. Lijin is looking for a kill on the pop. Oh, didn't expect the rest. And there you go. Lijin, Ultima Scout with a uh, decent lead. However, one thing that um, is kind of scary in teams is when you have one player at high percent, the other at low percent, and the high player dies like here, your teammate gets 2v1. Luckily, though, he died pretty fast. So, it looks like Boondocks is kind of trying to just chase Lijin around, which I actually disagree with. I think that uh, Puff does a very oh good job. That was probably supposed to be rest. I don't think it would have hit regardless. I think it was yeah. a little bit misspaced. Maybe a pound, I don't know. Uh, that was uh, definitely a weird choice. Actually, it was probably just up air, honestly. Right. Legend doing a lot of up, here's, up airs here. Yeah, up air is such a good tool. If you can get below both Puff and Barth, they're both weak. You know, it's not like a Falco or something who's just gonna like fall on you with a really powerful hitbox. So, Legend's just trying to get under him or above him. Solid down smash, and just a snag in that kill, and they have taken a pretty solid lead here. Yeah, Boondocks is getting a little desperate fishing for these rests. Um, I think if he just kind of switched his focus to, uh, like, kind of 2 v wanting the Marth and right. ignoring Lijin as much as possible, um, then I think that they'd have be having an easier time. But it's really hard for Puff to chase around Young Link. I mean, we all saw right. you know, Hunger Box and Armada, the famous sets. Making great use of these projectiles there, oh. kind of uh, limiting the recovery options. Wow, that up air did not kill. Um, but that one is going to catch him out of his double jump. Gets another one? Nope, not quite. And now four stocks to one. Puff is a hard character to come back with as well. This is certainly not looking good. Rest certainly is not an option in that situation. Nice spike. All right, and that was a relatively quick cool game one. I think they're going to want to go to a smaller stage here, possibly? I think they're going to want to go to Final Destination if it's not banned. Okay. Because um, no platforms for Young Link makes it really hard for him to kind of play the runaway game. Right. But uh, I, I like this switch from Martha Fox. I'm not sure how good Lawn Chair's Fox is. I've never seen him play before, but I think Fox is a much better pick when you're trying to chase around characters like Marth and Young Link. But you gotta be careful in this situation that you don't get gifts. Oh my. That was likely an input error from Jigglypuff. A couple of uh, costly input errors. Yeah. Probably just, you know, the turny nerves being on stream. Right. Not actually. Wow. Maybe not. Maybe he's just trying to go for the cheese. I don't really agree with that. I think. Just kind of uh, leaving Launcher out there to dry sometimes though when he is doing that. Right, yeah. If he just kind of focuses on supporting Launcher and taking any rest he thinks he can get, right. um, I think that, especially if he tries tries to get rest on Marth, Marth's such an easy character to set rest up on. But once again, we see he's going for the Young Link primarily. However, they're not doing too bad, you know? Nobody's died yet. Oh, and he actually manages to get the rollout. We, we actually don't know what we're talking about. The rollout, the rollout seeker, that's the 20XX rollout there. All right, but really close game here. Um, 
Lijin is going to have to be careful that he doesn't take any strong hits because he does not want to leave Marth to get 2v1 when there's a puff involved. Right. High percent, but he's still just going in there, playing pretty aggressive. I do agree with that as long as it's against the Jigglypuff. Right. Because Fox can just kind of tag you with an air or a back air or something and you're, you know, you're done. But Jigglypuff, she really has to either commit to an edge guard, which is hard against Young Link, or get a really solid hit, which she can't really do from the egg. Though actually, I don't believe the Puff hit him at all that stuff. And here we see it again, going to the rollout. <laughs> That's uh, two for four. You won't be able to get back either. So first two times, he missed. Second two times, he hits. Maybe he's uh, he's figured out so, some new puff technology. Wow, triple down air. I've never seen that. Uh, that was pretty crazy. I thought for sure one of those was going to give a fire spike too. Right. Wow. Now it goes for the F-Smash, delays it as much as possible. And it actually worked out, manages to get the kill, and once again we see Lijin Ultimate Scout in a really strong position. He hit that one, it was on his own team. That, that counts as a negative one. Uh, he's one for five now. <laughs> <laughs> what a great projectile work here by Lijin. Yeah, that is one of the big, I mean, that's the big advantage of Young Link is he's, his bombs hit four times, I want to say, maybe six. No, I think it's four. Either way, they hit a ton of times and they can just be really disruptive, which is obviously very helpful in teams. Wow. Ultimate Scout with the uh, disrespect counters does not pull him off, though. Longchair gets uh, up tilted out of his. Oh, is he just shuffled nares there? I'm not Something. sure if Boondocks has given up here or just decided to leave his teammate to get beat up. But uh, whatever the plan was, it didn't work out, and we have a 2-0 victory. It just seemed like he might have been a little inexperienced with teams. Possibly. Uh, not really knowing the help out is, has made it all. Not sure who we have uh, coming up next here. I don't see anyone coming up just yet. I believe Carol S1 and uh, Budujin and Wake, they just had their match. Uh, they're still probably not a match.